And today's good news, the Muskogee County Sheriff Gregory, uh, excuse me, Greg Countryman and his staff welcomed a unique new deputy on Tuesday. It's been this deputy's dream to work in law enforcement and get this, he's only four years old. Great TV's Dylan Seymour introduces us to the new sheriff in town for the day. It meant the world to us to celebrate Armand. Um, we, cel we celebrate him every day, but for the Muskogee County Sheriff's Department to take part in making the celebration above and beyond what we could ever think, it was wonderful. Four-year-old Armand was diagnosed with brain cancer last year. His godmother, Janice Thornton, says he wanted to work in law enforcement, so she decided to ask the sheriff if he would be willing to meet Armand. Muskogee County Sheriff Greg Countryman says he and his deputies were happy to accommodate them and make the day special not only for Armand, but for the family. We wanted to make this a great day for him. We wanted to make it about the things that were near and dear to him. We gave him a grand escort here. We want to make sure that as he's fighting his battle that we can give him something to remember. When Armand was diagnosed with terminal brain cancer, his doctors say that he had roughly 12 to 15 months to live. Armand has surpassed that time frame and his godmother just wants to celebrate and remain hopeful. February of 2023, Armand was diagnosed with diffused midline glioma. That is a um, about a zero survivability type cancer. So I just wanted to celebrate him and his time. You know, only God knows his time. To see the strength within him is what was emotional. Uh, for me because he's taking this and uh, you know and he's enjoying every single day and it lets me know that how valuable life is and that every day that we wake up um, on this side that it's a good story regardless of what we face in our lives. And that was Dylan Seymour reporting. Armand and his family enjoyed their time with the sheriff and his deputies playing games, getting rides in law enforcement vehicles, and finishing the day with lunch and a bundle of toys from the deputies.